Senior non-commissioned officers from the 2nd Cavalry Regiment in southern Afghanistan are teaching Afghan National Army NCOs how to control the battlefield and make decisions quickly in stressful situations. The sole purpose of this course is to expand on the military and leadership skills of the ANA and to increase their survivability and lethality on the battlefield. The week-long Enhanced Leaders course focuses on the skills these NCOs need to be effective leaders. The main thing we emphasize are the troop leading procedures and you know it's basically at the platoon squad and team level and that's where we just want them to be doing rehearsals, good briefs, just a lot of things they can do at the platoon level to help support their uh, chain of command and uh, basically just show them how to take initiative as NCOs. Although some of the Afghan NCOs already had experience with a few of the topics, they realized they needed more training in critical areas. All the things they are teaching us here are very important, especially when we went to the range. They taught us different weapons tactics and how to zero our weapons properly. Everything we have learned over the last seven days has been very important and will help us in the future. Going forward, one of the most crucial skills they may need to know is how to save a life on the battlefield. I've learned how to help casualties. For example, we learned how to place the tourniquets and then call for a medevac, and that is important. The goal of the Afghan Enhanced Leaders course is to help the ANA develop more effective NCOs on the battlefield, where leaders are needed the most. Reporting from Kandahar Province, Afghanistan, I'm Army Sergeant Carl Greenwell.